statements made during this broadcast regarding products or the claims made about specific products have not been evaluated by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration. Products and treatments discussed are not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent disease. Make your physician aware of all nutritional supplements used and immediately notify your physician if you have any health concern or undiagnosed sign or symptom. Let's Talk Nutrition is a health talk show that features scientists, authors, nutrition specialists, personal trainers, holistic healers, and experts in traditional, natural, and integrative medicine. Listen for a chance to win daily prizes and follow Let's Talk Nutrition on Facebook and Instagram at Let's Talk Nutrition or on Twitter at LTN Radio. It's time for some inspiration. Tune in to get fit and healthy. It's time to talk about nutrition. Nutrition for your body, your mind, your spirit. It's time to talk about proper exercise, stress relief, Relief, eating well, and supplementation for when you don't. Get ready to take charge of your health because your health is your wealth and the wealth of those who care about and love you. It's time for Let's Talk Nutrition. Welcome to the show. Welcome to Let's Talk Nutrition. Great to be with you. Thanks for tuning in today. I'm uh, going to have a couple of guests in the first hour is uh, Hamilton uh, Cabanilla. And uh, Dr. Marie Deschel will be along in the uh, second portion of the show. Glad you could stop by. I'm glad to be here with you. And uh, we certainly are in the throes of the holiday season, no question. I've been talking about this for about a week or so. I do that every time, the, every year around this time, right? And it's appropriate. And uh, all the previous shows are on demand at letstalknutrition.com. The videos are right on the homepage. The audio can, audio portions of the show can be found under show schedule. And on previous shows in the past week or two, uh, the conversation about the holidays has taken uh, different thematic turns, right? And uh, you can go back and listen. Today, I, I was uh, speaking with Hamilton before going on air and uh, had asked him to think about the ho holiday season in terms of the food that we eat and what is it about the food that is beyond, I mean, there's a variety of different foods and there's always the issue of variety and quantity. Those are the general themes that are discussed or issues that are discussed relative to holiday food, diet and nutrition. The quantity we get, the quality we sort of get too. We know that some of these foods are high in salt, sugar, and fat, lots of calories, and so on. People intuitively get that. Don't need a degree in nutrition to figure that out. Eat too much and eat too much of the unhealthy food. Well, that's not the whole story. There's more going on here with holiday food and food generally. Food is not just food. That's a very important principle. Food is not just food. There's a difference in quality between and among different kinds of foods. And moreover, it's not just the quality but different foods have different effects. Different foods contain different nutrients. So, and I could go on with that theme. You get it. Food is not just food. And the issue that typically is not really discussed a lot, and, it's, and I don't think it's on the forefront of people's minds relative to holiday food or food generally, is the issue of enzymes. Now you're saying, wow, big deal. Well, it is a big deal. Let me tell you, it's a bigger deal than people realize. An enzyme deficiency is something that does happen relative to the food that we eat and relative to our own body's ability to make enzymes, to synthesize them. Aging being what it is, Enzyme production doesn't amp up, become even more um, productive 
and more prevalent as we age, in fact, it starts to wane and that becomes problematic, especially if you're eating food, and I'll say this and put it in air quotes, dead food. And you're thinking, why would that affect our health? That's no big deal. Well, if you understand what enzymes are, what they do, their, 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 their function, then you start to realize what a big deal it is. Previous shows, we have discussed that issue. What are enzymes? What, are their, what, are their, what is their structure? What is their function? I won't go through that today too much. Again, visit letstalknutrition.com. Those shows are on demand. And so Hamilton Cabanilla is my guest, and he's a, he's a, a great educator for Enzymatica. And he drove in from? Port Charlotte. Get into your mic. Port Charlotte, Florida. And it was raining like cats and dogs, you said. <laughs> Literally, Great Danes, St. Bernard's. <laughs> Big cats. Well, we're glad you got here safely. Thanks. Thanks for uh, driving over, too, by the way. And was that a couple of hours? Uh, hour 45. Okay, good enough. Um, so you heard my, my intro here, Hamilton. Uh, holiday foods, and I, I want to hear from you, your, you know, in your expert opinion. What is it about holiday foods that, in, the, in fact, in your mind, is problematic? Well, well, most of it, if we think of holiday foods, as you mentioned, not only the quantity, the quality, but also the amount of cooked foods, or, or as you mentioned, dead foods that that are on on the dinner table. If if we think of you know, holiday food and then a baked ham and a, you know, roasted turkey and, you know, mashed potatoes and stuffing and, you know, there's rarely even sight of, of a salad anywhere or some fresh fruit or, or anything in its raw state. And, and the big, you know, issue with that is all these cooked foods put a great toll on our bodies to try to break them down. As, as you mentioned, eating, as much as we enjoy it, as delicious, as much as we like it, it's a function that our body's trying to take this, you know, mass and convert it into nutrients, extract the nutrients. But when something is cooked, or processed, or dead, it puts a great toll in our body to try, and again, in many cases it doesn't, to produce the enzymes, to break down that food, extract the nutrients, and get the waste out. Uh, I can't remember the the guy that did it. <clears throat> Maybe it'll come to mind. He took, he had two sets of cats. Pottinger. Was was it Pottinger? Thank you. Dr. Pottinger, my man. You, you're good, Hamilton. He had one group of cats. He fed them raw food. The other group. He fed them cooked food. He did that for nine years, if my memory serves me. Am I right about that? Correct. A few generations, actually, of cats. I think four generations. Four generations. And he discovered generally that the cats that consumed the cooked food did not fare as well compared to the cats that ate the raw food. That's an interesting experiment. It wasn't done at Cornell, <laughs> but uh, the Cornell Food Lab, but a, a very intuitive Interesting, simple, designed experiment. Uh, I, I know we're not cats, but enzymes, cats, dogs, you know, horses, whatever, enzymes prevail, correct? It's true. In plants and animals. Correct. And, and, and it's scary, really. If we look at the details, and if we have the time, we can just Google Pottinger's cats. It is scary as generation to generation the decline um, that the cats were actually being born with. So uh, first generation, you know, didn't fare as good. Second generation, worse. So they were born already with certain deficiencies, certain defects. Third generation, that much worse. By the fourth, most couldn't even procreate. It was, it was that bad that they were being born with mental deficiencies and, and couldn't even procreate. This is, I mean... He, that was an ingenious experiment. I mean, to think about the simplicity of it, the, mm -hmm. how, how parsimonious it was and simple in design, but yet so, so um, effective in demonstrating the importance of enzymes. And then people will say, well, humans aren't cats. 
Well, oftentimes the experiments that are done with animals will extrapolate to humans in a very significant and meaningful way. So uh, this goes on all the time in science. Holiday foods. We certainly know we eat too much. We certainly know that we eat some of the wrong foods. And it's not just the salt, sugar, and fat. Many of the foods that, as you well pointed out, Hamilton, taste wonderful, look great on the table, um, make us feel good uh, psycho-emotionally, and, you know, they're yum, but <laughs> they may be enzyme deficient. Well, you're saying, what's well, only one meal? Well, it's not just the holidays either that we're talking about. We'll come back. We'll, we'll talk some more. Are you or someone you love being held captive by social anxiety, poor sleep, feelings of aggression or inability to focus? Neural Balance can help, and it's kosher certified and GMO free. Neural Balance is a tasty drink mix that contains the patented ingredient, anandinol. Anandinol was created by an endocrinologist and a pharmacist seeking an herbal solution to their own children's struggles. Neural Balance tastes great, it's easy to administer, and starts to work within the first 20 minutes by reducing anxious or aggressive behavior and restoring calm naturally without sedation or harmful side effects. Safe for children and adults, Neural Balance combines magnesium, CoQ10, B6, three types of passiflora, and a special blend of enzymes to bring peace, calm, and focus. To find Neural Balance at a health store near you, visit us at shopneuralbalance.com. Neural Balance, for a balanced life. Learn more at shopneuralbalance.com. Exclusively from Natural Factors. I'm Dr. Michael Murray. I'm very excited to have the opportunity to talk with you about PGX, a truly revolutionary natural product that works perfectly to help get at the core issues that make weight loss so difficult. PGX is a clinically proven way to help people to achieve their ideal body weight that is safe and natural. PGX leads to a dramatic reduction in the glycemic index of any food or meal. It also ultimately causes the release of compounds that achieve two important goals in weight loss. One, telling your brain that you're satisfied so you eat less, and two, improving the action of the hormone insulin. If you've ever tried to lose weight and failed, it's not your fault. You just need the tremendous support that PGX can provide. For more information on making your weight loss dream a near effortless reality, please go to pgx.com. When you're passionate about your health, that passion leads to the knowledge that exercise and a healthy diet are not always enough. Sometimes you need the extra nutritional boost that only supplements can provide. If you are looking for the leading national brands of vitamins, supplements, health, and beauty, weight loss, or sports nutrition products, look no further than Vitamin Discount Center. Voted Best Independent Chain by Vitamin Retailer Magazine, Vitamin Discount Center has been a trusted and valuable nutrition resource to the Tampa Bay area for over 15 years. With daily savings up to 50%, Vitamin Discount Center offers the best prices on the highest quality nutritional supplements. Not only will you find unbeatable value, your visit includes access to a staff educated on the application of products to help equip you with the products and information you need to proactively improve your health. To locate the store nearest you, visit vitamindiscountcenter.com, as well as access to articles on popular health topics, promotions, events, and thousands of products to shop from right at home. Your search for an affordable solution to better health is finally over. Vitamin Discount Center. For life for less. Are you waking up each day to the life you have to live or to the life you want to live? Better health shouldn't be left to chance. Smart choices to living longer and stronger include making Kyolic Aged Garlic Extract a part of your daily routine. For years, medical researchers have recommended adding Kyolic to the diet as a powerful tool to enhancing overall heart and immune health. Recent clinical studies at UCLA Medical Center using Kyolic suggest that garlic may slow plaque formation in the arteries and support healthy cholesterol and homocysteine levels. Previous research also shows Kyolic may enhance your immune system defenses. Kyolic is organic, odorless, and the only antioxidant garlic supplement available worldwide. Maintaining a healthier you could extend your life. Your wellness begins with Kyolic Aged Garlic Extract. Available everywhere fine nutritional supplements are sold. Visit Kyolic.com. That's K-Y-O-L-I-C.com. Or call 1-800-421-2998 for a free sample today.
Let's Talk Nutrition is brought to you by Form Essentials, makers of the Sleep Aid Solace. Now introducing Zinnia for healthy hair, skin, and nails. Garden of Life, empowering extraordinary health. Canavest, from seed to shelf. New chapter, the benefit of nature's wisdom. Nature's Dynamics, garden to gummy supplements made by dad. Natural factors, where great health begins. Let's Talk Nutrition, on the web at letstalknutrition.com. We're back from the break, so let's rejoin Dr. Michael Garko. Welcome back to Let's Talk Nutrition. Welcome to the show if you just dialed in. My guest is Hamilton Cabanilla, and Hamilton is an educator for Enzymedica. How long have you been working for Enzymedica? Um, actually, now in December, is going to be seven years. Good. And you travel around the country educating people about health, wellness? Correct. Consumer lectures, um, staff trainings, um, all different types of conferences. Mm -hmm. uh, I mentioned that I don't think that during the holiday season or probably any other time of year, for most people, there are some. I think there are a few. Enzymes are not on the forefront of their mind about health and wellness. You said to me that you even find that some of the so-called experts, that is the case as well, right? Yeah, that, that's true. Um, enzymes are, are still unknown or um, kind of untapped um, information um, that's out there, but yeah, very, very few people use it. We as a company have been at it for almost 18 years trying to, you know, spread the word. Education's a big focus for our company, and, and we still see lack of information even amongst health professionals about enzymes. Maybe, maybe part of the issue could be that um, uh, the connection between enzymes and what health purpose they serve or, or a lack of enzymes and how if you're enzyme deficient and or if your body isn't making enzymes as synthesizing them as well as it should or if you're eating food that doesn't contain the enzymes that it should, that the connection with that is, is not made to unhealth, uh, unhealthy conditions or disease. Right. Right. Right, right, right. And actually, in, in, in a conference I went to, it was really interesting. Um, it was a health conference, and they were talking about autism. And in a published paper, I forget which journal, medical journal, but as one of the foundations for autism, it listed a few different things that they have, and one of them was digestive enzyme deficiencies was the clinical term they gave for individuals in the autism spectrum as one of the root foundations for um, autism. So I was like, wow, they, they're actually talking about enzymes. So it was actually listed there. Mm -hmm. And on previous shows, we've talked about different types of enzymes. There's not just digestive enzymes. There are also what we call s systemic enzymes. Correct. And what are those? Those are the ones that work in everything else other than digestion, whether it's immune, cardiovascular, inflammation, everything else other than digestion. So, going back now to holiday food, and, uh, and we look at that wonderful table, that setting, whether it's Christmas or whatever holiday is being celebrated during this time of year, and it looks beautiful and tastes wonderful, but it may not be as healthy as it should be because it, it could be that the enzymes have been cooked out of the food or the food has been so processed that the, the food is now enzyme deficient. Is that really a big deal? It, it is, and, and, and sadly, the, the holiday season kind of um, amplifies or, or magnifies the effect, um, but I was reading a, a, a stat there, 90% of the foods here in America that are purchased are processed already. So they, they're already dead. It kind of magnifies during the holiday season also because of the quantity. Um, but sadly, something that happens year long and it's kind of magnified now uh, during the holiday season, but it has a big role, again, not only in the digestive symptoms of, of maybe you know gas, bloating, or any of those symptoms, but it can affect the rest of our health. I immunity, um, inflammatory symptoms we may be feeling, they're all tied into to digestion. It's amazing. 877-897-8255. 877-897-TALK. You are listening to Let's Talk Nutrition. Hamilton Cabanilla is my guest. Um, so it might not be a bad idea. <laughs> People may look at you a little oddly. If you put some Enzymedica enzymes on the, on the holiday table 
at each, you know, in the middle of the table, a few bottles um, and have tell people to take the enzymes with their meal. They would probably look at you a little oddly, right? <laughs> But they'll thank you later, you know. When they don't get the gas, the bloating, I think everybody will be thankful for that. And it's not just one meal that we're talking about. I'm using the holidays as a, as a, as a platform to really talk about it, generally speaking, uh, throughout the year, every meal. If, if it's true, if it's true that if your body is not synthesizing enzymes the way it should, to, to help digest proteins, fats, carbohydrates, starches. And if it's true that the majority of food that's being served up in not only in our culture, but other cultures as well is highly processed and enzyme deficient, that means in the long run, nutritionally speaking, you're deficient. Correct. Because, because again, food, as you clearly and, and very well put, Food is where we should be getting life. It, new, uh, vitamins, minerals, you name it, should be coming from our food. But if we're just swallowing it and it's kind of coming out of us, you know, undigested, uh, it, it just filled our tummy and came right up with no value for, for our bodies. Yeah, most people eat because they're hungry. Eating consciously, eating strategically, sounds like a very contrived mechanical thing to do. I dare say most people got up this morning, they're not thinking, I need to be practice conscious eating, I need to practice strategic eating. Strate by strategic, I mean, I'm eating with the purpose, with a therapeutic purpose, eating to nourish my body, eating to slow down the aging process, eating to moderate inflammation, eating to help prevent cardiovascular disease and so on. And most people just don't do that. They don't. No. And, and it's wonderful. Shows like yours are helping be, because education is key. Most people aren't aware that, that f what food really is and, and just eat, like you said, to, to f kill that hunger feeling. But food goes so much further beyond. When your alarm goes off, do you jump out of bed with excitement? Or does it take multiple alarms, a few snooze buttons, or a morning caffeine fix to get you going? These habits and daily stress cause a vicious cycle in which sleep becomes increasingly elusive. In fact, 54% of Americans report struggles to fall or stay asleep. For a better night's rest, look no further than Solace, an all-natural dietary supplement that supports healthy sleep and relaxation so you get the rest you need to wake up clear-eyed, alert, and ready for the day. Solace has given thousands a better night's rest and the power to take back their mornings while enjoying the day ahead of them. Solace is formulated with non-addictive, scientifically proven, all-natural ingredients that support sleep and relaxation, such as melatonin, tryptophan, and 5-HTP. For more information or to order Solace, visit takesolace.com. Solace, for healthy sleep, naturally. Looking for the perfect complement to your beauty regimen? Try Form Essentials Zinnia. The finest of its kind, Zinnia offers twice as much biotin as other formulas, which has proven to unlock the vibrancy in even the dullest of hair, skin, and nails. Zinnia breaks through and rejuvenates cells internally, helping you achieve the allure of effortless beauty. Reviving your hair, skin, and nails has never been easier. This essential blend of biotin, alpha-lipoic, and hyaluronic acid, collagen, and vitamin C creates lasting enhancements to your natural good looks. Don't go on wondering. You're worth the results. This combination of ingredients can only be found in Zinnia. Pamper yourself with a proven bit of affordable luxury and start looking your best. Ask for Zinnia by name at your nearest vitamin retailer to begin your journey to restored nails, head turning hair, and radiant skin today. For more information, visit formessentials.com.
Let's Talk Nutrition is brought to you by Nubian Heritage, Humble Beginnings, Advancing Wellness, Never Tested on Animals, Yerba Prima, Pioneers in Internal Cleansing, Country Life, a leader and authority in natural health and nutrition, Now Foods, our products work, Nordic Naturals, pure and great tasting omega oils, Kyolic, aging makes the finest garlic truly odorless. Let's Talk Nutrition, on the web at letstalknutrition.com. We're back from the break, so let's rejoin Dr. Michael Garko. The odds uh, are pretty good that your holiday dinner, whether that's Christmas or whatever holiday you're celebrating this time of year, when you look at the table, is not going to be constituted of a bunch of raw food. (laughs) Most likely not. Welcome back to Let's Talk Nutrition. And if you invited people over, they'd probably look at you and, and... I don't know. Maybe they leave (laughs) because nothing on the table but raw food. The point I'm trying to make is that these days there's a lot of talk about the raw food diet and the importance of raw foods because they're loaded with enzymes and it's living food as opposed to cooking the food and processing the food, which kills the enzymes, making the food, quote unquote, dead. Now, let's be real here this Christmas dinner or whatever dinner you're going to serve during this holiday season is going to have turkey, ham, and stuffing, and all the things that Hamilton Cabanilla mentioned, my guest today from Enzymetica, in describing that holiday meal. And food is made to be enjoyed, eaten to be enjoyed. And I'm not suggesting that you shouldn't eat those foods. What I am suggesting is that maybe you need a little enzyme help. And you might want to consider taking some digestive enzymes in the form of a supplement to help your body, especially if you're a little deeper into the lifespan and especially if your diet is not, you know, all that healthy. Welcome back, Hamilton. Uh, What would be a good enzyme supplement to take from Enzymetica, a general all-purpose enzyme that might help people, you know, do a little better during the holidays, eating too much of the food, eating too many of the wrong kinds of foods and so on? Well, Digest Gold is probably our best-selling, or it is our best-selling product, and it actually has been the best-selling digestive enzyme product for the last 10 years across the entire U.S. So seems to be doing well. People seem to like it. I mean, it's a full-spectrum uh, digestive enzyme, covers everything in your meals, protein, carbs, fibers, et cetera, um, and it's going to take away some of that stress. So in, in, in simple terms, it's kind of going to put back in the food the enzymes that were um, denatured or killed when it was cooked or processed. So it's a simple thing. It's nothing foreign, nothing, no, simply putting back in the food the enzymes that were lost. So that's a good product. Given that this is an evidence-based show, research is always referred to on this show constantly. I open the show every day talking about studies, refer to studies throughout my conversation with various guests from all over the world. When you go on PubMed and type in enzymes, and you look at the research that been, that's been done on enzymes and supplemental enzymes, it's pretty remarkable, correct? It is. It is, absolutely. And, and again, it, it's simple science. It, it's a catalyst. You add it to a substrate, a reaction happens, and in the case of digestion, it's simply going to break down your food. And without the enzymes, life as we know it, whether in plants or animals, would not exist, would it? Absolutely not. They they say, one book said, the earth would look like the moon without enzymes. And and what's so interesting to me and what has been hard to do is to push that idea to the forefront of people's um, health agenda, you know, to make them understand we probiotics has caught on. It seems now you even see probiotics being advertised on mainstream television, the internet, cable TV, everywhere, magazines, whatever. Enzymes, not so much. And I appreciate and thank you, by the way, I didn't thank you for the compliment about the show. We're trying to do that. We're trying to educate the public and make them more aware of these kinds of health and nutritionally related issues. Um, Some might say, well, you know, your body makes the enzymes to digest protein, carbohydrate, and fat. Why worry? Why worry about that? The fact is humans are 
the only, if, if we want to use the term animal, we are. that cooks its food. Every other animal eats it in its raw state. Even when they kill an animal, you could still say that dead animal has its enzymes. So that the enzymes in that dead animal that the lion is eating, for example, has its enzymes. It's going to help it break down when, when he's eating that, that animal there that he it just killed. We're the only ones that alter our food and basically kill the enzymes. So Even before we cook it, we alter it. Absolutely. Let's go to Tampa, Florida. Stephen, welcome to Let's Talk Nutrition. Stephen, thank you for holding. You know, just a comment about the animals. Uh, I'm sure you all have dogs or, or have had uh, dogs in your life. When they don't feel good, what do they do? They want to eat grass. Mm. Uh, lions and, and a lot of wild animals do that when they have the upset tummy. I want to mention uh, last couple of years I have given, uh, disguised as a multivitamin, <laughs> a uh, digestive enzyme to everyone at Thanksgiving dinner, which is usually 12 to 14 people. <laughs> and uh, I, you can't use the word digestive enzyme, Doc. I mean, they'd be, well, what's that? That sounds clinical. No, I, everybody's got to take a multivitamin if they're going to be here. You know, that's what I, what my wife looks up to me like, yeah, okay. But anyway, they, they all feel better. Yeah, you know, it, it's remarkable, Stephen. Um, you know, it took me a while to get it into my thick head <laughs> to, to put enzymes into my protocol because I was thinking, I, you know, I feel okay. Um, I'm, I'm digesting all right. I mean, I don't have excessive gas and bloating. Maybe that's TMI, but uh, <laughs> I, I, even people that don't have problems with all the news that's going on today, and your guest, I'm sure, as well aware as you are that that these issues have a direct correlation, you know, on the gut. I mean, all you have, I mean, you could receive a phone call right now from a relative, Doc, and what would happen? You would feel funny in the stomach, right? So, <laughs> Depending on the relative. <laughs> yeah, well, we're coming yeah, I mean, for, coming know, you, for you Christmas could, dinner. Get, I mean, you're, you say you had a daughter. I mean, she could say something that would upset you. Oh, absolutely. What absolutely. That gut flora is uh, being affected. So with all the things in the news, I think we should take the, the uh, enzyme and the probiotic. This is a, uh, a prophylactic against the world, basically. In, in a real sense, you know, it's interesting that you mentioned that when under stress for many people, Hamilton and Stephen, uh, when under stress, their di the digestive system for, for, it varies with different individuals, but the digestive system takes a real hit. They become constipated. They can't eat. They can't digest their food. They start having a lot of gas and bloating because they're under stress, which, of course, then affects the immune system. So Stephen's point is well made. Uh, take your probiotics, take your digestive enzymes. Even if you feel healthy and are healthy, it, it serves your body. You're taking a lot of stress off your body and you're practicing prevention. You Steve, know, doctor, how I originally got into stop eating fast food, I've been in the health foods for about 10 years, but stopped eating fast food about five years ago. I started visualizing that uh, two-pound uh, boar's head turkey sub, not the taste of it, but I started visualizing this thing right here in this paper is going to be inside me in five minutes. And that sounds silly, but that's how I stopped eating fast food. When I started vi actually visualizing that Big Mac, that's going to be inside me, not the taste of it, but that's going to be in me. Good point. I never thought of it that way. We'll be right back. At Nordic Naturals, we know that a commitment to deliver the world's safest, most effective omega oils requires an exceptional process. That's why we manage every step of production from boat to bottle. That includes sustainably sourcing wild-caught fish from well-managed fisheries. It means using state-of-the-art equipment and technology at our manufacturing plant in Arctic Norway. Nordic Naturals bottles and encapsulates our omega-3s at our own facility and carefully ships products from our eco-friendly headquarters in California. The result? Nordic Naturals products have received more than 40 awards for taste, innovation, and product excellence. You can trust the quality of Nordic Naturals products and know you're getting all the health benefits omega-3 fish oils offer. Nordic Naturals high quality, great tasting omega-3s make staying healthy easier for you and your family. When choosing an omega-3 fish oil product, choose the number one fish oil in the U.S. Choose Nordic Naturals. Available at natural product retailers or online at nordicnaturals.com. 
Feeling tired after your meal? Occasional gas, bloating, or indigestion at inopportune times? You may have an enzyme deficiency. Did you know that many common digestive discomforts can be caused by poor digestion? When food isn't completely digested, it begins to ferment in the digestive tract, which may cause uncomfortable symptoms. Digest Gold, America's number one selling enzyme product, offers unparalleled support for your digestive needs. It contains exclusive blends of enzymes optimized to be three times stronger and work more than six times faster than other leading digestive supplements. With just one capsule per meal, Digest Gold offers support to break down carbohydrates, fats, fiber, and protein. Enzymetica products are all natural, vegetarian, contain absolutely no fillers, and are vegan and kosher when possible. You'll find Digest Gold and other Enzymedica products at fine health food stores near you. These statements have not been evaluated by the Food and Drug Administration. This product is not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent any disease. As a family-owned company since 1968, Now Foods has spent the last 46 years building a legacy in the natural health industry as a trusted leader. Now provides a comprehensive approach to wellness by offering more than 1,400 high-quality health foods, supplements, sports nutrition, and personal care products at an affordable price. Now believes that natural is better. They don't use artificial colors, flavors, or sweeteners, and they offer many vegetarian, organic, and gluten-free products. Their foods are all non-GMO. Since their beginning, Now has grown to become an award-winning leader in the natural health industry. But one thing has never changed, their commitment to providing the highest quality products at the best value to empower people to lead healthier lives. High quality doesn't have to mean high price. From essential oils to amino acids, multivitamins to natural sweeteners, Now has you covered. To find a store near you that carries Now products or for more information, visit nowfoods.com. That's nowfoods.com. Are you tired of taking vitamin pills or powders? How about gummy vitamins with high fructose, corn syrup, or coloring? Finally, you have a choice with Nature's Dynamic Whole Food Gummy Supplements and Probiotics made by a dad. Imagine getting benefits of your garden in a delicious gummy supplement. Nature's Dynamics utilizes organic, plant-based vitamin and mineral sources with non-GMO, gluten, soy, and dairy-free ingredients in a delicious gummy for the whole family. Nature's Dynamics has berry garden gummies made by a dad, multivitamin, omega-3, and probiotics for kids, Body Boost Joint Relief, Whole Food Bone and Calcium Gummy, Whole Food Immune and Vitamin C Gummy, Whole Food Omega-3 Gummy, Be Beautiful Hair, Skin and Nails Gummy, Prenatal Plus Gummy, Whole Food Probiotics for Digestive Support, and Body Boost Energy and Wellness Multivitamin for him and her in a delicious, easy-to-digest gummy. To learn more about Nature's Dynamics or to find a retailer near you, visit naturesdynamics.com or madebyadad.com. Nature's Dynamics, Garden to Gummy Supplements, Made by a Dad. Hi, I'm Jordan Rubin, founder and CEO of Garden of Life. Oceans 3 was created with a simple premise in mind. Develop a line of premium omega-3 fish oil formulations that met or exceeded the market leader in quality. And then go beyond omega-3 by providing amplified benefits and value to the consumer. Oceans 3 contains ultra-pure, high-potency fish oil, along with astaxanthin and fucoxanthin. Each of these ingredients, when taken individually, have superb benefits. When they are combined into the exciting compound omegaxanthin, they work synergistically to amplify their already amazing benefits. In addition to the synergy of omegaxanthin, Oceans 3 offers unrivaled purity and greater value than the leading omega-3 fish oils available today, making the Oceans 3 family of products the best choice for anyone looking to add a healthy dose of omega-3 fats and a giant dose of extraordinary health to their lives. Let's Talk Nutrition is brought to you by A. Vogel, Europe's leading brand of herbal medicine. Nutrix Hawaii, more nutrition, better health, purely Hawaiian. Renew Life, the digestive care company. Enzymedica, the enzyme experts. North American Urban Spice, the only oregano oil you can take on a daily basis. Jaro Formulas, superior nutrition and formulation. Let's Talk Nutrition, on the web at letstalknutrition.com. We're back from the break, so let's rejoin Dr. Michael Garko. Potatoes. Canola oil, hydrogenated soybean oil, natural beef flavor, wheat and milk derivatives, citric acid as a preservative, dextrose, sodium acid, sodium acid pyrophosphate, that may helps maintain color, salt, hmm. 
Uh, I could go on. Dimethyl poly uh, siloxane. Can hardly pronounce it. Those are some. <laughs> those are some of the ingredients in a French fry. And I'm not going to pick on McDonald's, but I'm just saying. Try to digest that. <laughs> Welcome back to Let's Talk Nutrition. You better eat some enzymes if you're going to if you're going to go fast food. You better go with those enzymes that do things fast. They're catalysts. My guest is <laughs> Hamilton Cabanilla, and it's great to have him on. He's an educator for Enzymetica. So the Digest Gold would be a wonderful supplement for people to take during the holiday season, given the quantity of food and given the kind of food that they're eating, uh, would serve them well, but move beyond the holidays and take it every day. Uh, when's the best time to take a digestive enzyme uh, in a supplement form? Generally right before you begin eating. Um, it, it, our vegetarian capsule is designed to open very quickly, 30 seconds, 60 seconds, it opens. Uh, the enzymes are released. So as food is coming down your esophagus, it's gonna make contact with the food and actually begin something that a lot of people don't know. There, there's a pre-digestive section of our stomach, that, that upper part, food comes down and sits in that upper part where the natural enzymes of the food are supposed to be working on it. In the meantime, you know, the lower part is, is starting to create the hydrochloric acid, starting to prepare that environment, but it sits anywhere from 30 minutes to 60 minutes in that upper portion where, again, the natural enzymes or supplemental enzymes start breaking down the food. But if we're eating dead foods and not supplementing, it's literally sitting there doing nothing, waiting then to go down. And, and again, it puts a great toll on our body to try to produce all those enzymes. Mm -hmm. And as I said, as you get older, unfortunately, it's, you know, as I say, one, some of the things we'd like to keep, we lose. And some of the things we like to lose, we keep. You can figure out what those are. I mentioned those in specific on other shows, but we tend to lose our ability to synthesize enzymes as we age to digest protein, carbohydrates, fats, fiber, you know, cellulose and whatnot. Uh, and therefore, that's where dietary supplementation with enzymes would serve a good purpose. And I'm sure uh, from an, given all the science that we have regarding enzymes, digestive enzymes, systemic enzymes, metabolic enzymes, whatever, uh, there, and there's a bunch of science, just go to PubMed and start rooting around there and you'll spend the rest of the day and probably the rest of the week trying to get through that literature. Um, Anecdotally, do you have people calling, talking about Digest Gold or any of these other uh, wonderful supplement products from Enzymedica? Absolutely. At the headquarters, we get uh, constant calls, um, especially with, with kind of unconnected or seemingly unrelated benefits. They, they may start taking Digest Gold. Again, they had gas, bloating, et cetera. But then they'll call saying, well, you know, my nagging back pain is getting better or my knee would always hurt and, and after taking the digestive enzyme it's feeling better why would that be and that's what they ask why but it's a digestive enzyme it's because we're taking stress off the body that work it would have had to have done to digest our food that enzymatic energy can focus elsewhere in the body and isn't it is there's there's there are studies to support this this claim enzymes can help moderate the inflammation in fact when you take enzymes, these what we call systemic enzymes, proteolytic enzymes on an empty stomach, they will help clean up some of the debris uh, that's, you know, floating around in your bloodstream and in the, with respect to inflammation, right? Correct, because all, most of those things that are causing the inflammation or affecting us, uh, our immune system, are protein-based. So the enzymes can, can break down that inappropriate protein and relieve the problem. And those proteins, the body does not like those proteins uh, coursing through the bloodstream. Uh, and they, it does promote inflammation. And enzyme therapy has been around a long time. Even in, there are now even traditional doctors that are prescribing enzyme therapy for patients that suffer from inflammation. And the, well, well when you come back on another day, because we're almost out of time for this portion of the show, maybe we can talk about systemic enzymes and uh, some other enzo, you know, some enzymatica choices that uh, people can make. 
So the Digest Gold would be a good one to take. Any others? Sure. Um, we also make our other major popular digestive enzymes, Digest Spectrum. So if they suspect there's some type of dairy intolerance or, or gluten intolerance, um, something of that nature, Digest Spectrum has higher ratios of those enzymes to address those food intolerances. Digest Spectrum? Correct. Mm. Uh, and so you're recommending two that the the enzymes be taken right before the meal. Could you take them during the meal or even after if you forgot? Absolutely. If you forget even, you know, 10, 15 minutes, you know, you can still take it. You'll still have a benefit. Absolutely. And if you took the digestive enzymes on an empty stomach, they would sort of function like systemic enzymes then, wouldn't they? Correct. Um, some will. because Some it, won't. Yeah, because it all depends on, on the pH they're designed to work in. The pH of our blood is very specific, but you will get some support. And the science of enzymes, is that, that literature is quite robust. If you're interested in wanting to learn more about enzymes, you can go to pubmed.gov, for example, and you can even uh, type in digestive enzymes, dietary supplements, enzymes, any key words, and then you'll start to see the studies, the clinical trials that have been done. This is not um, hocus pocus. It is not uh, on the fringe. It's just out of our awareness Although we're getting there, maybe they'll, you know, in a few years, the di the enzymes generally will, uh, Hamilton will become as familiar to people now as probiotics. 10, 15, 20 years ago, probi probiotics, people didn't know it. They didn't know. They didn't care. Now it's in the mainstream. Absolutely. They may not know exactly what a probiotic is, but they know it's good for them. They, right. And now you have traditional doctors even prescribing probiotics to their patients. Absolutely. You are listening to Let's Talk Nutrition. My guest was uh, Hamilton Cabanilla or Cabanello, but it's really Cabanilla, isn't it? Exactly. Yeah. And um, so what nationality is that? Uh, my parents are from Ecuador. I was born in New York, but it's Ecuadorian, originally from Spain. Now you speak Spanish? Si. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. That's it? Just see? No, you speak Spanish. No, you're... Yeah, I speak, yeah, I do lectures even in Spanish, like in the Miami area or Texas. Oh, do you like really? That. Yeah, I can do a full lecture in Spanish. You know what I have found about the Latins is that when they're dialed into health and, and get, they get into that modality, boy, they're committed. I mean, they really get passionate about it. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, it's been done for generations in, in, in the Spanish culture, you know, kind of herbs here and this and that. So they're a little more in touch with, with nature, if you will. I know. Well, I wish you and your family the happiest and healthiest of holidays. Thanks for Thank driving you, over Gardner. today. Enza Medica. Wonderful. Your health is your wealth. We'll be back.
statements made during this broadcast regarding products or the claims made about specific products have not been evaluated by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration. Products and treatments discussed are not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent disease. Make your physician aware of all nutritional supplements used and immediately notify your physician if you have any health concern or undiagnosed sign or symptom. Let's Talk Nutrition is a health talk show that features scientists, authors, nutrition specialists, personal trainers, holistic healers, and experts in traditional, natural, and integrative medicine. Listen for a chance to win daily prizes and follow Let's Talk Nutrition on Facebook and Instagram at Let's Talk Nutrition or on Twitter at LTN Radio. It's time for some inspiration. Tune in to get fit and healthy. It's time to talk about nutrition. Nutrition for your body, your mind, your spirit. It's time to talk about proper exercise, stress relief, eating well, and supplementation for when you don't. Get ready to take charge of your health because your health is your wealth and the wealth of those who care about and love you. It's time for Let's Talk Nutrition. Welcome to the show. Welcome to the show. That's what she says every day. And welcome to the show indeed. Glad you're there. I'm glad to be here with you. And uh, you are, just in case you didn't catch it, you are listening to Let's Talk Nutrition. And uh, the show is Coast to Coast. Check your local listings for the time and day or days it plays in your particular market and support your local radio station that airs Let's Talk Nutrition, as well as your health stores. My guest in this portion of the show is Dr. Marita Show, and Dr. Show uh, is an international guest because she lives in Canada, and uh, Dr. Show has been a frequent guest on Let's Talk Nutrition, one of the, one of the uh, LTN faves around here. Uh, we like Dr. Show a lot because, you know, she's sensible. <laughs> she does a good job. She knows her stuff. She shows up prepared. It makes my job a lot easier. We love that. And uh, it is the holiday season. So is every year around this time, I do devote some time, a considerable amount of time, to talking about the holidays and from a health perspective, a nutritional point of view. And it's important to do that. And then maybe to try to persuade people, convince them to carry over some of the ideas and the principles and the practices, health practices during the holidays to carry it over beyond New Year's and move into, you know, maybe a little pattern where you start to do a little better with your health and taking better charge of your health and wellness. And uh, again, you know, Dr. Shows in practice and so she sees patients all the time. And I like that because having a, a guest on who is in the trench day in and day out dealing with real life health issues with, with people that are trying to figure things out. And sometimes it's easy and sometimes not so much. Dr. Show, welcome back to Let's Talk Nutrition. It's great to have you on. I, I have, we haven't talked for a while, so it's good to see you on the radio. We have your image. We have your image up at letstalknutrition.com because the show streams. Great. Yeah. I'm uh, happy to be on the show again. Right. We're I was on holidays last month. That's why. Oh, you were on a <laughs> holiday. Where did you go? Somewhere in Canada? Uh, <laughs> we, no, we actually went to Cuba. Get out. Yeah. You, did you really? Where did you go? Havana? Where did you go? No, we actually went to, um, on the other side, it's about 10 hours away from Havana. We were in a little resort town on the other side of the island, no, near um, a little town called Holguin. Yeah, it was really pretty. It was uh, very relaxing. How long were you there? Uh, we were there for a week. Wow. Any issues getting from Canada to Cuba? Uh, no. No, we just flew through Toronto. Did they pull you out and pull you to the side and frisk you, Dr. Show? <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Take you into that other room? <laughs> because you look suspicious? No, I hardly think so. <laughs> I hardly think so. Wow, you went to Cuba. How good is that? That's, boy, you're adventurous. Yeah, no, it was great. We, um, we've we always wanted to go, and so... Um, yeah, it was a great opportunity, and and we're we're glad we went. It was quite a trek from where we live. I we're know. on the um, west coast. <laughs> mention to the so. uh, mention to the listener and to the viewer where you live in Canada, so they have a sense of that. 
So I live in Victoria, which is um, on Vancouver Island, which is on the west coast of British Columbia, so just above Washington. So we're actually about a 20-minute flight from Seattle. I see. So we're really close to Seattle. It must have, it must have what, what, about uh, eight hours, seven, seven hours to get there? Um, driving from no, Seattle? Probably. No, 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 no. From, from, Sea- from, from where you live to Cuba, how, what was the flight? Oh, um, see, we went through Toronto, so it was a five-hour flight to Toronto and then a four, almost a four-hour flight down to Cuba. Yeah, I said about eight hours, seven, eight hours, and I was not off an hour, nine hours. Wow. How was, being a nutritionist, how was the food? <laughs> I got I to gotta, I gotta, I gotta ask. <laughs> That's a great question. Um, you know what, that was the one thing that, that we did, well, I kind of struggled a little bit with. You did? Because yeah, well, because they don't have as um, they don't have as much variety as far as like um, healthy food, right? Mm. So they have fruit, which is great, and they have um, lots of seafood, right? Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah, I was really just craving when I got back from when we got back from our trip. We, I was just craving a salad. I I so. am, <laughs> and, and there's not much meat there except pork. They do have pork, but the- yeah, they do pork, and they have. I mean, they do have chicken, and, and but a lot of fish and um, prawns, like shrimp and things like that. Yes, I'm, I'm familiar with the food um, food supply in Cuba. Uh, people would be shocked to know that many Cubans, they struggle with getting sufficient amount of food and nourishment. I mean, varieties of foods just not available. Uh, maybe that will get better once the maybe someday when the embargo is lifted, and yeah. things will, more things will be be able to be imported into Cuba. Uh, Cuba is a wonderful country, and for the last fifty years has been. Well, we all know that story, and it's interesting how it's reflected that <laughs> reflected in the nutrition of all things in the food, the day to day food supply, and what's not available. So you had a little bit of an issue with that then. Yeah, I mean I. I mean, I ate food. It was fine. It was just yeah. You um, weren't starving to death. No, I, <laughs> no. We were. We stayed in the resort, and they had quite a a variety. It was just probably not um, the norm for me. Like I was eating um, things like you were saying pork. Like I'm not a big pork eater, so there were certain things that I was eating more so than I wouldn't. What did you notice when you ate that food? Anything? Um. Yeah. I mean, your your stomach feels a little bit off. Like the first few days, if you're eating things that you're not um, used to eating. I know my husband's stomach was a little bit off the first day or so. You should have taken some natural uh, factors, digestive enzymes with you. <laughs> I had all those things. I was fully equipped. I had my probiotics. I had digestive enzymes. Yeah. So, yeah. So that, I mean, all those things really, really helped. But all in all, I mean, the, the people are lovely down there. They're they so are. friendly. And, they are. Um, it's it's a beautiful. It's a beautiful country, really. It is a beautiful country. Maybe there'll come a day. I mean, you know, from Florida, it's a, you know, from Miami, it's what? Yeah, you're so close. I mean, you can spit and hit it, right? You get on a plane, you're there in 45 minutes. Yeah, uh, it's amazing. I mean, it would be people used to do that would fly to Cuba for the weekend, right? Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you guys on on the East Coast, you guys have a lot of, um, I mean, you've got Cuba, Dominican, Bahamas, Bermuda. Absolutely. You've got. (laughs) It's great. And even Florida is beautiful, too. Yeah, Florida is very nice. So that's good, uh, Dr. Show. I mean, uh, good for you. You're, I thought maybe you went to Paris or someplace like that, you know. You know. (laughs) I haven't been to Europe for a long time, actually. I haven't been either. I need to go. Um, I, I've threatened to visit Cuba, but we'll see. I'm afraid I'd be pulled over and put, taken into the room and frisked. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, uh, no, I would, I would strongly recommend it. And I think if we go next time, I'd love to stay closer to see we, the one thing I would have loved to do is see Havana, old Havana, which we were about a 10 hour drive. From yeah. Havana. It's too far. Yeah. So it was just, yeah, it was too just much. too far. So. I think next time we'd probably stay in the Veradero area, and then, you know, you can do like a day trip over to Havana or spend a few nights in Havana. Yeah. Very good. Good for you. So uh, here we are in the middle of the holiday season. 
Uh, you're back in your practice. Uh, I don't know what the patients, your patients are saying to you, and I don't know what happens during the holiday season in, in a clinical setting. I want to find out and see yeah. what your ideas are about how maybe we can get through this holiday in one piece, you know, yeah, uh, <laughs> exactly. and uh, deal, <laughs> deal with the stress, deal with the abundance of food, um, and oftentimes food that may not be so healthy, may taste great, look great, smell great, but mm, nutritionally not so great. So we'll see what's on your mind. I'm always curious as to, because I know you're so thoughtful about these things and you're talking to patients all the time. You are listening to Let's Talk Nutrition and you'll be listening to Dr. Marita's show, Coast to Coast. Hi, I'm Kate. I try to eat a healthy diet, but the irony of eating healthy foods, like broccoli or beans, is that even though they're healthy for us, they can still cause occasional digestive upsets. That's why I take a DigestSmart high-potency enzyme with every meal. DigestSmart is from Renew Life, the digestive care experts. It's the first digestive enzyme certified by Izyme, the international enzyme testing program. Each capsule provides a full spectrum of 25 powerful plant-based raw enzymes to break down each major food group, including carbs, fats, proteins, and fiber. Digest Smart Enzymes also feature targeted delivery capsules to reach your intestines, where 90% of digestion occurs. Digest Smart promotes more complete breakdown of the foods you eat and optimizes nutrient availability. Plus, it helps ease digestive upsets and supports your overall digestive health. Now that's really smart. Digest Smart is from the makers of Ultimate Flora Probiotics, and both are available in health food stores everywhere. Are you suffering from those awful allergies? Hay fever, sneezing, watery eyes. Here's some advice you won't want to miss. I'm a doctor, and my patients used to dread allergy season. But then I discovered A. Bogle Allergy Relief, a unique combination of natural ingredients that usually addresses every one of my patients' symptoms. And while it's clear that the vast majority of my patients benefit significantly from Avogel Allergy Relief, what's even more amazing is that after using it, at least half of my patients' symptoms didn't return. As a doctor, that's the kind of outcome my patients and I can appreciate. Get doctor-recommended Avogel Allergy Relief for your allergy symptoms. It's proven safe, it doesn't make you drowsy, it's fast-acting, and it may even help prevent your allergies from returning. Available at Vitamin Discount Centers, Richards, Rollin' Oats, Vitamin Shop, Nutrition Smart, and other fine health food stores. The ever-increasing stress and toxicity we are exposed to from our environment, diets, and lifestyles make internal cleansing a necessary part of a good health regimen. Founded in 1980, Yerba Prima was the first company to launch a whole-body internal cleansing kit. Since that time, they have continued to develop and manufacture a complete range of all-natural, high-quality fiber and internal cleansing products. By using all-natural psyllium fiber and no harmful stimulant laxatives, all Yerba Prima fiber and internal cleansing products can be used over a long period of time to ensure optimal health and regularity. With nearly 30 years dedicated to all-natural cleansing products, it's easy to see why Yerba Prima is a leader in the fiber and cleansing products category. Learn more at yerbaprima.com, Y-E-R-B-A-P-R-I-M-A.com, or visit your local health retailer. Yerba Prima, pioneer in internal cleansing products. Hi, I'm Dr. Michael Murray with a minute of important health news. One of my all-time favorite natural products is a special extract of licorice known as DGL. DGL is short for deglycerizinated licorice, but I tell my patients that it stands for darn good licorice. DGL is made by removing the compound in licorice that can raise blood pressure in some people. Double-blind clinical studies have shown DGL is quite useful in healing stomach and intestinal ulcers. In fact, in head-to-head -head studies, it has actually outperformed popular anti-ulcer drugs. But Rather than inhibit the release of stomach acid, DGL stimulates the normal defense mechanisms that prevent ulcer formation and promote healing. Clinical studies have not only shown DGL to be extremely effective, but also that it is completely without side effects. Clearly, DGL is a better choice.
Let's Talk Nutrition is brought to you by Form Essentials, makers of the Sleep Aid Solace. Now introducing Zinnia for healthy hair, skin, and nails. Garden of Life, empowering extraordinary health. Canavest, from seed to shelf. New chapter, the benefit of nature's wisdom. Nature's Dynamics, garden to gummy supplements made by dad. Natural factors, where great health begins. Let's Talk Nutrition, on the web at letstalknutrition.com. We're back from the break, so let's rejoin Dr. Michael Garko. You are listening to Let's Talk Nutrition, and my guest in this portion of the show is Dr. Marita Show. Dr. Marita is on the show. That's a lovely first name, Dr. Marita. I love that name, Marita. Uh, what do your patients call you? Hey, you. Hey, Dr. You. Hey, Dr. Uh, I'm actually quite um, informal in my clinical office um, mm. setting. So, yeah, most of my patients call me by my first name or they'll call me um, Dr. Marita. Yeah. Really? That's interesting. Yeah. So this time of year, even up there in Vancouver, British Columbia, <laughs> what what goes on with people clinically speaking during this time of year? Is there is there some particular set of characteristics that would describe this time of year and clinically? Oh, you know, I see a lot of people um, who will have a lot of stress. <laughs> Imagine that. <laughs> um, so a lot of stress during the holidays. Um, a lot of you were mentioning, you know, too many indulgences, so maybe too much alcohol, too many appies at those Christmas parties. So I do see a lot of people with like digestive concerns or digestive upset as well. Um, and sleep issues too, but I think that kind of goes hand in hand with, you know, upset stomach as well as, you know, the increased stress and the demands of, you know, social engagements, family coming to visit, Christmas shopping and all of it. So if I took each one of those, stress, mm -hmm. digestive issues, sleep, if you start writing prescriptions for all three of those things, the, the, I mean, the patient would, would be too busy taking the, the, the meds to enjoy the holidays. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you couldn't be – and there, there are medications for each one of those, you know, for stress management, for digestive issues, for sleep issues, Lord knows – the multi-million dollar business in sleep medications. Um, you're a naturopath. You're a naturopathic physician. You went to, a, you have wonderful, wonderful training. You went to a wonderful school. Um, how do you deal with this? If you have a patient comes in and says, Dr. Marita, you know, I just, I feel on the edge here. It's, it's, this is a lot of stress for me. I'm not getting enough sleep. I'm, my stomach is upset. I can't even go to the bathroom. I'm constipated. Um, I'm this. I'm that. What do you What do you say, go, uh, Bob? Go get a martini. Well, <laughs> well <laughs> yeah, I know a lot of my patients would like to do that, but um, um, the first thing I I usually will assess is um, I always ask them, you know, what they are doing, like if they're able to do anything during the day as far as um, like unwinding, like. So even if it is just some deep breathing exercises, 10 or 15 minutes during the day, if they're enrolled in yoga or meditation, um, the nice thing is is that I, I in my um, my office now, I actually just moved my practice a few months ago um, to a more integrative health center, and um, we actually offer all these. We offer like meditation classes and yoga classes, and so wow. it's wonderful because after a visit, I can actually say, okay, you know what? You're, if they're not doing anything like that, if they're just go, go, go constantly, um, I can actually enroll them into a class right there in my office so that they really, you know, stay committed to something. Um, and then, of course, there are definitely things that are going to wind the person um, up more um, as far as diet is concerned, right? So I work a lot with nutrition because I believe that that really is the foundation um, and then there are definitely some, some excellent dietary supplements that, that can be um, um, used as well with a healthy diet, um, which we can talk about in just a moment. But, you know, things like excess caffeine, right? If you're feeling stressed out or anxious mm -hmm. or panicky, the last thing you want to do is, you know, be drinking five, six, seven cups of coffee during the day just to try to make it through the day. So. Mm -hmm. You know, I talk to my patients about that, about sugar, you know, excess sugar. Yes, I know it's the holidays. Yes, we don't, you know, we don't want to kind of deprive ourselves of everything. Mm. But, you know, you kind of have to pick and choose your battles. So I always kind of have this rule that if you know you have a couple of um, in social engagements coming up, say on like a Friday or Saturday night, 
then to really prepare your body so that your immune system and your whole nervous system isn't more stressed, you know, try to um, eat a little bit more healthier during the week, drink a little bit more water, maybe not have that extra glass of wine during the week or, you know, that extra treat in the lunchroom at work. Um, because you know that you know if you're at a at a nice holiday party, um, you want to you should want to still enjoy yourself. Of right? course, of course. <laughs> yeah, I mean, uh, so, we don't want to you don't want to be uh, Dr. Marita Grinch, <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, <laughs> and neither do I. Um, this time of year is to be enjoyed. I don't think there's anything wrong with going to the parties and enjoying yourself and having, oh, you know, a few, absolutely not. And you know, having a drink or sure. having, you know, dessert or whatnot. Sure. But I think it's when we're not used to having, um, it's so funny. I was talking to a patient actually yesterday about this and, um, she was saying, I think she's in her late seventies and she was saying, you know, when she was a child, um, you know, they had a beautiful Christmas dinner and, um, do you remember those little, I think they still have them, those little after eight, mint chocolate oh yes 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 yeah so she said you know and then um you know there was like five or six children and and after dinner you know they all had like a couple of after eight chocolates and that was their dessert but she was telling me she said because now she's got her her kids have you know she's got grandchildren they do a big christmas do and she said she's like now marita you know, it's not just one dessert or one treat. She's like, it's like 10 different desserts, <laughs> right? Like, it's, it's the chocolate, and it's the candy canes, and it's the cheesecake, and then it's That's like, right. you know, the bread pudding. And, I mean, there's like this whole platter of different, you know, desserts. And I'm not saying that that's for every household but i understand you know, that abundance see, right you know, seem to have yeah it's like this abundance of sugar um i know we'll, we'll, we'll get it to happened. well when we get back well let's talk about that in this business of food cravings <clears throat> and we'll get into this a little bit more and give you some even more specific ideas to consider and some recommendations you know there's that ugly dreaded ugly christmas sweater but there's some number of other un unwanted holiday gifts i'll list those and maybe what we can do about them looking for the perfect complement to your beauty regimen try form essentials zinnia the finest of its kind zinnia offers twice as much biotin as other formulas which has proven to unlock the vibrancy in even the dullest of hair skin and nails zinnia breaks through and rejuvenates cells internally helping you achieve the allure of effortless beauty Reviving your hair, skin, and nails has never been easier. This essential blend of biotin, alpha-lipoic, and hyaluronic acid, collagen, and vitamin C creates lasting enhancements to your natural good looks. Don't go on wondering. You're worth the results. This combination of ingredients can only be found in Zinnia. Pamper yourself with a proven bit of affordable luxury and start looking your best. Ask for Zinnia by name at your nearest vitamin retailer to begin your journey to restored nails, head-turning hair, and radiant skin today. For more information, visit formessentials.com. When your alarm goes off, do you jump out of bed with excitement? Or does it take multiple alarms, a few snooze buttons, or a morning caffeine fix to get you going? These habits and daily stress cause a vicious cycle in which sleep becomes increasingly elusive. In fact, 54% of Americans report struggles to fall or stay asleep. For a better night's rest, look no further than Solace, an all-natural dietary supplement that supports healthy sleep and relaxation so you get the rest you need to wake up clear-eyed, alert, and ready for the day. Solace has given thousands a better night's rest and the power to take back their mornings while enjoying the day ahead of them. Solace is formulated with non-addictive, scientifically proven, all-natural ingredients that support sleep and relaxation, such as melatonin, tryptophan, and 5-HTP. For more information or to order Solace, visit takesolace.com. Solace, for healthy sleep naturally.
Let's Talk Nutrition is brought to you by Nubian Heritage, Humble Beginnings, Advancing Wellness, Never Tested on Animals, Yerba Prima, Pioneers in Internal Cleansing, Country Life, a leader and authority in natural health and nutrition, Now Foods, our products work, Nordic Naturals, pure and great tasting omega oils, Kyolic, aging makes the finest garlic truly odorless. Let's Talk Nutrition, on the web at letstalknutrition.com. We're back from the break, so let's rejoin Dr. Michael Garko. So, here we are. Holidays. It's a great time of year. I love it. Wonderful. Uh, notwithstanding all of the stress and whatnot. <laughs> and, that, and that ugly, <laughs> dreaded, ugly Christmas sweater that you might get. There are other, other un- un- unwanted holiday gifts, such as cold and flu, lots of stress that Dr. Marita was re- referencing, an abundance of unhealthy foods and beverages, Sometimes loneliness and depression, not so funny. Traveling nightmares, never mind weight gain, you know, that unhealthy, unreturnable gift that keeps on giving. Dr. Show, welcome back. (laughs) (laughs) Merry Christmas. (laughs) (laughs) I know, right? (laughs) Yeah. So um, this is interesting. Uh, You know, what's a doctor to do in clinical practice, like such as yourself? Of course, I'm not an MD. I'm I'm just a mere PhD researcher, journalist. You know, I don't do clinical work um, and nutritionist. But nevertheless, um, I have a great deal of regard for what you have to deal with in clinical practice because people are looking for results and somebody comes in during the holidays saying that they're stressed, they're not getting enough sleep and rest. And you're not you're not so inclined to write a bunch of prescriptions, are you? Um, no, absolutely not. (laughs) Um, I think the biggest thing, and I know we've talked about this before on previous shows, but I think the biggest, um, probably, uh, system that I target is, and it's related back to the nervous system and also a lot of other, um, endocrine systems in the body and pathways is supporting the adrenal glands. I just don't think you can go wrong there. And, Mm -hmm. you know, for the um, listeners that, are not familiar with what the adrenal glands do is that they're essentially your stress glands. So they control how well you adapt to or cope with stress during the holidays or other stressful situations that creep up in, you know, in the future. So I feel like, you know, keeping the stress response well supported and, you know, um, there's a a product by Natural Factors by the Women's Sense line called Adrena Sense that is um, a product that, you know, most of my patients are, are taking because I think, you know, everyone can really use adrenal support. Um, but I feel like that really helps people adapt and feel more calm and, um, you know, supports their energy levels. And then indirectly, you know, if you help support the stress response, then that helps to keep the digestive system working a lot better. Better, It helps with anxiety, your mood. It helps with your sleep. Um, so indirectly, it affects a lot of other um, health concerns that people might be experiencing this time of the year. Sure. <laughs> so just so we are clear, this isn't Dr. Show making stuff up. This, <laughs> <laughs> what I'm getting at is this, Dr. Marita, is that there's a lot of research to support all that you just said about the adrenal glands, adrenal fatigue, and so on and so on. I mean, we could go on PubMed or Cochrane any of those research sites, and we could find one study after another to support all that you just said. Isn't that right? Oh, I just, um, a colleague and, and um, a colleague of mine and I just wrote um, a brand new book that hopefully will be launched in the U.S. soon, but we just launched it um, in Canada, and it's like a 400-page book oh my. on um, stress and the disease connection. Um, and the bulk of the book is all the research that's behind, you know, stress and sleep, stress and menopause, stress and thyroid, stress and digestion, stress and inflammation, um, stress and Alzheimer's and cognitive function. Um, yeah. So. <laughs> and I'm sure, I'm sure, I'm sure that there's, you probably have hundreds, if not thousands of references in that, in that, in that particular uh, book. Oh yeah. I mean, it's. And, um, you know, it was, you know, I'm grateful to have written it by, with one of my um, my mentors, Dr. Karen Jensen, who oh. you was know, an expert also oh, yeah, yeah, on yeah, yeah. that topic. 
And she's a retired naturopathic doctor now, but I mean, she's got 25 to 30 years of experience in the field of naturopathic medicine as well as hormone um, balance and, and um, adrenal issues. So, yeah, so we just wrote, it's almost actually a, a sequel to the Adrenal Stress Connection, which I'm sure you're familiar with, I am. with which is more like a little booklet. But, yeah, yes. we just we decided to write a, a much more comprehensive Wonderful. Um, Good for you. Congra- yeah. Congratulations. Yeah. So with sleep, I am familiar with natural factors, tranquil sleep, and I'm and I'll go on the record. I've been on the record and you can call me and give me what for if it doesn't turn out to be so. I've been taking I don't have insomnia, but I've been taking tranquil sleep about three, four years now. I only take one. It's like a little lozenger uh and you, you can taste sweet. You put it in your mouth right before you go to bed. And I get better quality sleep. I uh, feel better when I wake up. It's just better. <clears throat> Again, I don't have yeah. insomnia. And that <laughs> tranquil sleep is wonderful. So I even take half a dose, and I do great with it. Yeah, it's, it's definitely um, that formula definitely is one of my go-tos in my practice. Um, I actually take it myself when I'm traveling, I find, if, especially if I'm going – to the east coast um with the time difference even though it's only three hours but i find just even that three hours sometimes can um sort of disrupt my natural circadian rhythms so yeah i know it's a great formula it's a little bit of melatonin um some l-theanine which is really nice um to help calm the mind and um i think there's a little bit of yeah there's a little bit of a 5-htp in there that's well. it only three ingredients sure. melatonin L-theanine and 5-HTP. That's it. That product is fabulous. And I often, um, so this time of year, I'm often recommending that as well as um, I often combine it with the Pharmagaba. um, Also by Natural Factors, they have the little chewables chewable Pharmagabas. And I find those those work really, really good for um, people that are in acute stressful situations, they're feeling, you know, they have panic attacks or just generalized anxiety. Um, so I sometimes will recommend combining the Pharmagaba with the Tranquil Sleep before bed. Or you can actually take, um, I have some patients that just take the Pharmagaba during the day if mm-hmm. they're in very stressful situations at work or they've got a lot going on. Um, it works wonders. Um, and I actually even recommended it for some um, like teenagers or kids that have a lot of, you know, school stress around exam time. Um, you know, if they're trying to get papers done, it can work really well, um, again, for just stress anxiety. And the nature of the stress response, which is called the fight or flight response, is that cortisol gets released. So if you're under stress from the time you get up until you go to bed, you're going to build up an inventory of cortisol. Cortisol yeah. should be higher in the morning, lower in the evening, because cortisol will disrupt the sleep architecture and keep you up. Hence, when you're under stress all day long, you got all that excess cortisol build up, and then you can't sleep. In a nutshell, that's what's going on in terms of one of the consequences of stress. Right, Dr. Uh, Marita? Yeah, absolutely. That's exactly what's happening. And so it's really about, and that's where I feel... Um, you know, really getting them to the root of the problem with supporting the adrenals, which will help to mod- rebalance and modulate those cortisol levels so that they are increasing when they're supposed to and decreasing, you Thank- know, appropriately. Very good. We'll be right back. More. Feel tired, lethargic, or irritable? Take solace. You're one of millions of Americans that has trouble falling asleep or staying asleep. In fact, according to a national survey, 54% of adults have trouble sleeping. So what can you do about it? Take Solace. Solace is an all-natural dietary supplement formulated to support healthy sleep and relaxation. Solace can help you fall asleep and stay asleep naturally. Formulated with all-natural ingredients, Solace is non-addictive and won't leave you feeling groggy in the morning. Take Solace an hour before bed and feel the calming effects of this extreme extensively researched sleep and relaxation aid. For more information on Solace, call toll-free 877-533-7066 or visit takesolace.com. That's 877-533-7066 or take solus.com. Look for Solace in your local health and nutrition store. Solace for a good night's rest naturally. 
At Canavest, we believe that the future of hemp is unlimited, and through innovative and responsible application and science, we will enhance the prosperity and well-being of our customers, employees, and communities. As pioneers, our long-term goal at Canavest is to locate hemp seed processing mills near to our future family of hemp farmers. These local factories will convert hemp seed into nutritious oil, protein powders, bread flour, and hemp meal. Canavest supports local efforts and believes that sustainability starts locally. Canavest was named one of the Nutritional Outlook's Best of 2014, and we are committed to pioneering the hemp revolution as the world's leading producer of quality hemp-derived CBD products. Resistance to change is in great part the result of trying to do today's job with yesterday's tools and with yesterday's concepts. The hemp revolution is here, and it's up to all of us to change perception and to impact policy. Will you join us in this movement? Learn more about the education and science behind Canavest at Canavest.com. Coenzyme Q10 is a powerful antioxidant nutrient. It protects against free radical damage, supports heart function, energy production, and immune response. Aging reduces our ability to absorb CoQ10 from our diet. So supplementing with a highly absorbable form of CoQ10 is the first step to ensuring optimal levels in the body. Secondly, typical CoQ10 supplements are in a ubiquinon or non-reduced form. For the body to use that type of CoQ10, it must first convert it to ubiquinol or the reduced form. QH Absorb is Gerald formula's highly absorbable and bioavailable CoQ10 supplement. Not only is QH Absorb more absorbable than traditional CoQ10 supplements, but as ubiquinol, it's already in a reduced bioavailable form. Your body can use QH Absorb without having to do any conversion work. Ask specifically for Gero Formulas QH Absorb at your favorite vitamin retailer. For more information on QH Absorb, go to Gero.com. That's J-A-R-R-O-W for the best and highly absorbable bioavailable CoQ10 supplements. Feeling tired after your meal? Occasional gas, bloating, or indigestion at inopportune times? You may have an enzyme deficiency. Did you know that many common digestive discomforts can be caused by poor digestion? When food isn't completely digested, it begins to ferment in the digestive tract, which may cause uncomfortable symptoms. Digest Gold, America's number one selling enzyme product, offers unparalleled support for your digestive needs. It contains exclusive blends of enzymes optimized to be three times stronger and work more than six times faster than other leading digestive supplements. With just one capsule per meal, Digest Gold offers support to break down carbohydrates, fats, fiber, and protein. Enzymetica products are all natural, vegetarian, contain absolutely no fillers, and are vegan and kosher when possible. You'll find Digest Gold and other Enzymedica products at fine health food stores near you. These statements have not been evaluated by the Food and Drug Administration. This product is not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent any disease. When you're passionate about your health, that passion leads to the knowledge that exercise and a healthy diet are not always enough. Sometimes you need the extra nutritional boost that only supplements can provide. If you are looking for the leading national brands of vitamins, supplements, health, and beauty, weight loss, or sports nutrition products, look no further than Vitamin D. Discount Center. Voted Best Independent Chain by Vitamin Retailer Magazine. Vitamin Discount Center has been a trusted and valuable nutrition resource to the Tampa Bay area for over 15 years. With daily savings up to 50%, Vitamin Discount Center offers the best prices on the highest quality nutritional supplements. Not only will you find unbeatable value, your visit includes access to a staff educated on the application of products to help equip you with the products and information you need to proactively improve your health. To locate the store nearest you, visit Vitamin Discount Center Com, as well as access to articles on popular health topics, promotions, events, and thousands of products to shop from right at home. Your search for an affordable solution to better health is finally over. Vitamin Discount Center. For life, for less. Let's Talk Nutrition is brought to you by A. Vogel, Europe's leading brand of herbal medicine. Nutrix Hawaii, more nutrition, better health, purely Hawaiian. Renew Life, the digestive care company. Enzymedica, the enzyme experts. North American Urban Spice, the only oregano oil you can take on a daily basis. Jaro Formulas, superior nutrition and formulation. Let's Talk Nutrition, on the web at letstalknutrition.com. We're back from the break, so let's rejoin Dr. Michael Garko. Here's, <laughs> here's the LTN health question of the day. So, during this holiday season, I've given a number of recommendations. Practice conscious eating. Drink lots of water. And I, there's a whole list of them. 
One that I often refer to is use smaller plates and flatware. Now, somebody might be thinking, now he's going to make stuff up here. There's no science to support that. Well, let me tell you, there was a study called Ice Cream Illusions, Bowls, Spoons, and Self-Served Portions. You can look it up. It was an interesting study. And in the study, they broke, uh, they had different groups. And in the one group, they gave them a large spoon and a big bowl. In the other group, they gave them a small bowl and a small spoon. Here's the question. <laughs> and they put ice cream in the bowl. <laughs> How much more ice cream did the people serve themselves when they had the large spoon and the big bowl? 27% more? 37% more or 57% more. How much more, I, and by the way, they were unaware of how much they were putting in the bowl when they then interviewed them. How much more ice cream did people put in the bowl when they had a large bowl and a big spoon? How much more ice cream did they do that, put into the bowl compared to the group that had a small bowl and a small spoon? 27% more, 37% or 57%. By the way, that study was out of the Georgia Institute of Technology. I can give you the reference if you're interested. 877-897-8255. 877-897-TALK. So, Dr. Show, when you're sitting there a little depressed and you got that chocolate chip haagen in the freezer, <laughs> use a small bowl and a small spoon. You would never do that, though. I, don't, I can never see you doing that. Well, I, my go-to is coconut bliss. <laughs> coconut bliss good for you dr show keeping it real i love it <laughs> coconut bliss <laughs> a little bit of self-disclosure really good. that's good no that's great you're and not perfect it comes in the tiniest little containers so you know just doing like a couple of tablespoons just that's that's enough for me right right so, you know, this business, uh, you know, practice conscious eating. I also recommend divide your plate, your plate into thirds. You know, one third should be protein, two thirds should be vegetables and fruit and, um, and, and so on. You know, limit your intake of the refined processed carbs. I'm going to say eliminate them, limit, and so on. I, give, I have a number of recommendations, but you get the point, right? Yeah, absolutely. No, I, I, um, I liked what you said before, too, about, you know, your plate, you know, instead of, you know, take a smaller plate or a smaller spoon if you're at a, um, you know, a party or, you know, where there's a lot of appetizers. Because obviously if you take a large plate, you're going to most often pile more food onto that plate, right? No, no question about it. You know, back in the 50s on those Oldsmobiles and Buicks and Chevys, they had big hubcaps. They were giant. When your plate looks like that hubcap off of 55 Buick, <laughs> that plate is too big. <laughs> Let's go to Clearwater, Florida. Chris, welcome to the show, Chris. Howdy. Is the answer 27%? 27%? No, it's not 27%. Um, it was more than that. But don't don't let that ever discourage you from calling me back again, though, Okay. All right. Well, thank you very much. Yeah. Thank, thank you, Chris. So it's not 27%. It's more than you think. When they used a large bowl and a large spoon, how much more ice cream did people put into the bowl? 37% more or 57% more? 877-897-8255. Coconut bliss, huh? <laughs> That's very good. <laughs> You've had it, right? It's really good. I've never had coconut bliss, no. You haven't? Oh, my goodness. I have to commit that nutritional sin. That's one I have not. You know, I have not. Uh, digestively speaking, is there something you could recommend from a supplement perspective that would help during the holidays? Oh, probiotics. Oh, good. Go ahead. Natural Factors has a couple, I think. Yeah. No, they've got great... Uh, um, a long line of great probiotics. 
Um, but yeah, I actually, well, probiotics are kind of one of those supplements that I typically recommend for most of my patients to take. Because again, you know, healthy gut is sort of a, an important foundation for health as well. Mm -hmm. So it's always a good idea, you know, to start taking your probiotics or just take a probiotic um, as maintenance uh, during during the um, the months prior to Christmas or just all the time because you're also going to support your immune system that way as well. Another recommendation I have is start with a salad. As it turns out, salad greens and other vegetables put into salads uh, are low energy dense foods, number one. And these foods, these foods then provide fewer calories for larger portions of food and then create a feeling of fullness because there's fiber in the food. So start a holiday meal or a non-holiday meal for that matter with a salad that'll help you eat less food while consuming less calories. That's a good idea, no? Yeah, no, that's a great idea. Simple. It's a small win. I'm a big fan of small wins. Let's go to Sheru in Tampa, Florida. Sheru, welcome to the hey, show. And, uh, hi, Marita. There you go. Hi. There you hi. go. I had uh, the pleasure of being at your um, talk last year in Tampa. So. She, she, oh, excellent. Yeah, she saw you when you came to Tampa and gave her talk, remember? Oh, yeah. No, that was a great event. Yeah, it was lots of fun. It's so, great. It's so, great. And, um, uh, I also arm myself with PGX, Dr. Garko, and I try to go eat out. Oh, oh! You you take the PGX, which is yeah, a yeah. Just if yeah, if I'm going to eat out um, to a restaurant, maybe or you know. That's a good idea. PGX yeah. is a uh, uh, you know wonderful soluble fiber product right. made by natural factors. That's, that's a that way I can indulge in a little more. <laughs> there you go. PGX yeah, that's is a great. Good idea too. Good idea, Sheru. That's right. <laughs> so, what's the answer? Thirty-seven uh, percent. With uh, fifty-seven percent. Uh, yeah, fifty. They put fifty-seven percent more ice cream in the bowl when they had a bigger spoon and a bigger bowl. Wow. So there you go. Congratulations. I can't it though, but um, I guess that's true. <laughs> uh, have you had coconut bliss? Have you ever um, had? Uh, not coconut bliss, but uh, we do love coconuts because back in India, you know. Yeah, it's a big Even deal. Before all this is popular here, you know, we grew up with uh, coconut in our gun. Uh, Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Show. Your health is your wealth.